Hello everyone, Oli the Repair Dude is here again. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to sync music and movies into your iPhone 5S bypass on iOS 10.3.3 using the Silver 6.1 A7 factory activation. As you can see, I got an iPhone 5S that is already bypassed on iOS 10.3.3 and it is activation locked on the Finder. That means I cannot sync music and movies. Please note that the Silver 6.1 factory activation is tethered. That means if the phone ran out of battery or it started, you will need to do the factory activation again if you want to sync movies and songs. Now for the first step which is to install Homebrew. Go to Safari, search Homebrew. Siri has suggested me homebrew.sh, I mean brew.sh. Go there, click this emoji to copy, go to terminal, and paste the command to install homebrew. Press enter or return, enter your Mac OS password. enter let it install I'll click silver for the time being enter the Mac OS password if prompted again now it's downloading and installing homebrew this will take some time Once Homebrew is finished installing, install dependency.sh. You can now close the browser. Open Silver 6.1 now. Go to Checkmain iCloud Bypass. iOS 14 iCloud Bypass. You will get this. Click Continue. Click Install Necessary Files. Click OK. Type C sudo chmod755. Drag and drop the dependencies file. Enter. Enter your Mac OS password again. After which, drag and drop dependencies.sh file and hit enter or return. Press enter again as we already installed Xcode while installing Homebrew. Allow it, allow it to install. While waiting, you can click done back and stay at the home page of Silver 6.1 allow dependency.sh to be installed <coughs> press enter to fix send and retrieve response this Patch is made by me. Once you're done, Silver is ready to use. Close terminal window and close the finder. Click RAM disk factory activation. Click A7 iOS 10.0 to 10.3.3. Select device, select iPhone 5S, click start. Now let's enter Pawn DFU mode. Press and hold both home and power button for at least 10 seconds 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 let go press and hold the home button only for at least 5 seconds 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to see whether it's on DFV mode if it's on iPhone software, iPhone recovery mode, that means you're in DFV mode. Click enter upon DFV mode. This may fail, so you might have to redo the process to enter DFV mode. Click enter upon DFV mode. Anyway.
the exploit is unreliable, hence it may fail. As you can see, now this is the failed attempt. Allow it to go to error. It may take many many times for it to succeed. If you see this, we do the process of entering con DFU mode. First, enter DFU mode by pressing and holding the power and home button for 10 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let go and press and hold the home button for 5 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. When you get this, in the finder, close it and click try again. This may fail many times, so this requires some luck and patience. Yes! Your device is in pawn DFU mode, and it took me two tries. Click OK, click Allow Unsigned Files. Once you get this, click OK, click Load Verbose Remedies. And you can close Finder and wait. You see some verbose boot thingy on the screen. And boom! Verbose boot thingy on the screen. Click OK. Click Done. The next step is to relay device info. Click that. Click yes. Click got it. Now click mount the file system. Click OK. And finally install pre-activation files. Click continue. And allow the device to reboot. Boom. Reboot. You get this. Click OK. Allow the device to boot. And boom, the device had booted. Go to the home screen. Tap OK for the no SIM card installed. Click Attempt to activate on Mac. Since we already installed dependencies and connected to Wi Fi, as you can see, my Mac is, I mean, my Hackintosh is already on Wi Fi. Click Wi Fi on, let's go. Allow it to activate. This will take a while. Boom! You get no SIM card installed. Tap OK. And you get successfully activated device. A reminder, the factory activation is tethered. If you allow the battery to run out or reboot, you will have to redo the process if you want to sync music or movies. But whatever content you just sync will stay on the device. I'll click OK for that. Click Finder. Click on iPhone. Click Trust. And allow it to load. Click Get Started. I'll click on music. I can show you what's my song, I mean my music. I recently added music, this is from the YouTube music library. I'll play out on my hanging loss installation. The file is working, the music file is working. Now close music, click sync music onto iPhone, select entire music library. If you don't want to sync any movies, you can untick include videos. I'm not going to see any movies as I don't have any movies. Click apply. It's backing up though. Repairing the sync, waiting for changes to apply. Sync music. Let's go to the music library. Songs. And the music is on the phone. This is from the YouTube Music Library, as it is not copyrighted. And there you have it. 
how to sync music and even movies to your bypass iPhone 5s on iOS 10.3.3. I really hope you enjoy my tutorial. Please like, share and comment on my video, subscribe to my channel and please do donate. The link to donate is in the description below and see you in the next video.